All right, let's look at the controls of the pedal. We've got a gain knob, volume, mix, and you can mix between your original and distorted signal. But also what was added was an input jack here where you can add an expression pedal. And this is a TRS, so you'll need a TRS cable for that. And we got a mid switch and a bass switch for adding and cutting frequencies. Clipping, three modes, a gain switch, and also our EQ knobs down here, bass, mid, and treble. Let's get started with the video. I got the gain switch in the high mode position, the clipping, got it centered, and it's uh, just barely creating some compression there. In the bass, I've got it cut. In the mid frequency, I've got the switch in the middle. Let's take a listen. And also, I've got the expression pedal hooked up so I can control the mix knob. <laughs> And as you can tell, the gain is um, pretty heavy on this pedal. So let's turn it down some. It's pretty sweet. Let's uh, pop that high gain switch down now. And even with the switch in the low gain position, it's a pretty sweet sounding pedal. Let's take and crank it back up. So just the clipping. Let's adjust that clipping switch. Whoa. So the pedal is quite versatile and I really loved the fact that I can switch between that highly overdriven signal back to my clean. If you look where we at, we're at 12 o'clock 
on the gain knob. Let's turn it up more. say it's one of my favorite overdrive pedals of all time there's so much it offers and i will put a link in the description to their website so you can check out the details but this is tim calloway just trying to keep it real have a great day <laughs>